I'm back today with the second part of the Atelier Collection full collection overview. Um, as I was saying last time, they have split up some of their collections and sort of renamed them on their website. So this would be part two of the original collection, which is now called Chic Absolu. There are four fragrances in this collection, and these are supposed to be clean, transparent, and elegant. I've got my notes here. And uh, the first one is Grand Neroli. Um, I'm not a fan of Neroli normally, but for me, and for this being a Neroli scent, this wasn't too bad. Um, I like that it was on the bitter side, um, which if I am gonna wear Neroli, I like it bitter. <laughs> the, um, the Neroli mixed with the Pettigrain and the Galbanum, um, I think really helped it. Um, at least helped me like it a little bit more. There's a tiny bit of vanilla in the background, but it's definitely not punchy or anything. It's just enough to kind of round the edges off a little bit. Um, I do get some bergamot for about the first 30 minutes. This one lasted about three hours and then uh, turned straight into a skin scent. It wasn't too sweet, um, but uh, again, the wear time on um, a lot of these Atelier fragrances is not the best. The next one I tried was Bois Blanc, and I really like the fragrance of this one. Um, I, for about the first two hours, I get mostly bergamot and pink pepper, and for the second two hours, I get mostly vetiver and wood. It's got a decent projection um, for an atelier. It's about an elbow's length projection. I, I like that it's a two-parter and it almost smells like two completely different fragrances. Yeah, and four hours is a pretty decent time for this one, I think. And next I tried Treffel Peur. Um, it, this one was very fresh and uplifting. I wish it was stronger. I get um, basil, violet, oak moss, and a little bit of cardamom. That's mostly what I smell from this. I really like the way this smells. I really like the fragrance of it, but it only lasts like an hour. Um, which is super unfortunate because I love the way this smells, but it just does not last. It has no lasting power. Last in this collection is Oolong Infini. Uh, this is another one that I wish was stronger. Um, it has a very nice tea scent. Basically, mostly what I smell is the tea scent and the Gaiac wood. Um, the tea scent is very nice. The Gaiac wood is very strong. It's a little funky, so if you don't like funky, this one might not be for you, um, but I like it because it's weird. <laughs> it lasts an hour on my skin, so totally not worth it to me. Um, I'm a sucker for tea scents, which is why I like this one at all, is because I like the tea aspect of it, but it lasts an hour. And honestly, I like the scent of truffle pear more, but again, that one only lasts an hour or two. Um, so I think uh, that this collection is supposed to be on the transparent side is probably not doing it any favors as far as the lasting power goes. Those are the four fragrances that are in the Chic Absolute line. That is all. I'll be back uh, with part three. If you're new here, please subscribe. It would mean a lot to me. Leave me a comment. I will definitely reply. Uh, my social media links are listed below as well. And that is all for today. Thank you. Bye.